All right, guys. Welcome back to some TFT with me, McCrathy. We have a Galio Hero Augment. Galio has plus three range and gains 15 mana and six ability power on each attack. I mean, we're going to go with that, right? Why wouldn't we? Um, the thing is, I don't know what to give him. Uh, let's think about this for a second. So, Galio has range now, and he gains 15 mana and 6 ability power on each attack. His ability deals 125% more damage. Uh, oh, this is... Fire two magic bolts that converge on the target, dealing magic damage to enemies they pass through. He's got 90 mana, so we probably want a Rage Blade on him. Not a Runons, not a Last Whisper. Uh, he is a magic tank. So this is very much like the... <coughs> uh, the whatchamacallit that we had. Let's uh, take this out. By the way, if you didn't see my last video, it was amazing. You should watch it. Uh, Vanguard Mage. I guess it's mages we want, right? I have this weird, like, right now I've got these things here. Also, Vanguard. Do we want Vanguard? Durability runs. Okay. So he gets durability when he's shielded, but honestly, I think it's I think it's probably mage is best for this. Uh, so let's just uh, go for that. Okay, we do have a two star Nila Nila Nila. I think this is maybe better. Although you know what, I just took out the dragon bonus. Probably not as good. Let's see if something good here for him. Not blue buff. He's got ninety mana. I don't like it's quicksilver man. All of these kind of suck to be honest. Static Shiv is probably okay for him. I think I'll go Static Shiv and we'll see how this goes. Let's just try it out. See what happens. But yeah, basically just want to do that. Uh, reduce incoming. Okay, so it actually does replace this totally. Uh, we'll do a coin flip. Why not? Let's put the mage in. We need three mages, though. That's the problem. All right, let's just sell all this crap we're not using. Uh, let's put this on him. Why not? I don't think it's runons, and I don't think it's quicksilver. We do have our magic, a magnetic remover, rather. Not magic remover. Magnetic remover, if we need it. Uh, what we really need is a tank, though. That's what we really need here. So, let's build our team. Uh, we start... Actually, no, I'm just going to pick the Galio so he's at the front. Okay, so we got the Galio. So we're obviously going some mages. So uh, we want Zoe... No, Zoe's a scholar. Uh, who's the mage I've already got? Yeah, Soraka is in. Uh, who's the other one here? Yeah, Seraphine. So this is going to be a two-star reroll comp, right? Or uh, level six, two-cost reroll comp. Uh, Vex is a mage, and so is Vagar. I think we want to take this, right? Uh, for the Rage Blade, 100%. Um, yeah, what else? Uh, so this gives us five. We can get to seven with the Nami and the, not Smolder, uh, Nora and Yumi. So this gives us seven mage. Uh, so mages cast their abilities twice and have modified total ability power. So that's probably the way to go there. Now the problem here is, as you can see, we only have one tank. So we're probably going to want to pick up another tank, and it's probably going to be a Vanguard. So Tom Kench, uh, Mordekaiser, those are going to be the two things that we want to that we want to pick up, so to speak. Uh, yeah, Rage Blade on him is going to be great. I think we'll probably take the Static Shiva off later. I think think that might be better. Uh, fire two magic bolts that converge on the target, each dealing magic damage to enemies they pass through. Yeah, I think that's pretty good. I think that'll be fine. I'm going to have some lemonade because it's hot. Mm. Delicious. Okay. So we're rolling it. Six. We don't have any two-star units, though, or two-cost units. I would love to get some more two-cost units in. I just don't know what's going to fit in here, right? Galio. Nunu is a bastion. 
Uh, Rumble is a Vanguard. We could go Rumble, and he is a tank. So we could like we could do this whole thing here, right? We have two Sugarcraft here as well. Then let's try to do this. This will be our like level ten best case scenario sort of thing. Uh, did we put this in? Probably. Hey, put this in for that. Get the money back. <clears throat> have another mage here, but uh, does, yeah, that's better than this, obviously. Okay, now we got our team. We just need to make something happen here. So I guess Ginsu's, uh, what else would be really good on this? Um, maybe the crit jewel gauntlet? Uh, but he gets, yeah, he gets bonus mana and ability power for the rest of combat each attack so he's getting that stacking stuff so honestly like two rage blades is probably better or even three rage blades maybe triple rage blade is that the way to go <laughs> it was that augment where you get like all rage blades all of your items turn into rage blades that'd be pretty funny yeah i think it's just attack speed on him because it gives you so much ability power and mana. You don't need anything else, really. That's probably the way to go. Yeah, I would love to get a better tank, but I just don't have it at this moment in time. But by the time we hit six, we should have 50 gold. Well, we should have 50 gold after this, but we should be able to hit six pretty soon and start rolling for him. Once we get three star, we just move on. No matter what Soraka Seraphine and Rumble are doing, we just as soon as we hit three star, we move on because we need to get to eight, uh, or maybe maybe seven. We roll for seven for the Vex. I think it's probably pretty good too. We'll likely get one or two Vex while we're uh, while we're going for Galio anyway, so it won't be it won't be the biggest uh, struggle for us. Okay, that's good for Vex. And another Rage Blade. Or do I go Nasher's Tooth? I'm I'm loving the Nasher's Tooth these days. Actually, it's it's really good. All of your items turn into Static Shiv for one round. Yeah, let's do it. Totally, let's do it, guys. Uh, I guess I can't tell what all these are gonna be, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna put any more items down. But yeah, why not have fun? Shit. Enjoy yourself, young people, young friends. Just put another Galio in, just uh, just cause. Actually, we'll put this in because he's another tank. Oops, that wasn't supposed to go there. Put this in just to have another tank in there. Another Galio doesn't really help us that much, uh, but the tank does. We'll let the Swain come in later. Maybe take the secondary aggro. Yeah, we did. Galio, you're so funny. You're so funny and useless, Galio. <laughs> That was a silly term. Yeah. Well, whatever. We're on the PBE. We're having fun. We're just, you know how it goes. We're just dicking around. We are just dicking around. Now, what is better? I, I just did a Shivana, not Shivana, a um, uh, Cassiopeia, which was amazing. Oh, gain a recurve bow. Oh, I don't need the recurve bow, though. I need the other thing. But this guy gives him 12% attack speed. That's actually pretty busted, too. Uh, I don't want this. I don't want this. First time you have 161.8 or more gold, gain a two-star, five-cost champion, and three items tailored to them. What? What are the chances I get a Nora and Yumi out of that, though? I'm going to take this. I know it's kind of silly, but that's what I'm going to do. I know. I know. I'm okay with it. Uh, this popped off. What happened there? I, I had that pop off. I, I have a Nasher's Tooth. Do I really want that, though? It is pretty good. I'm going to do it, because you know what? We're going to end up changing some stuff anyway. Uh, moving some stuff around. We have another Nash's Tooth as well. Is it double Nash's Tooth? That would be pretty crazy. No, it's almost always this. See, he, he hits his ability so fast that the Nash's Tooth actually doesn't do that much, because he just he's always at his attack speed cap anyway. So maybe just not the best, you know? I'm going to roll these two. I don't know if this works, but I'm going to try it. And have some more lemonade. 
because it was 32 degrees today in Calgary. And it was hot. I'm not going to lie. It was pretty hot. Okay, that is good. Uh, actually, having oops, having this is probably better because of the shapeshifter bonus. Or have them both in. Uh, that's also pretty good. Uh, what do we need here? Fairy would be nice. Uh, sugar craft would be nice. Let's just roll here and see what we can find here. Okay, we can get a sugar craft. Uh, this one. Gain a random minor effect for one gold as well. Sure, why not? What does Soraka do this time? Start on the target to use magic damage and then heals a nearby ally. I mean, that could be good, right? Maybe we go three star Soraka? She heals twice as a mage, or she uh, does her damage twice as a mage. So that is pretty good. I feel like this is like a new bard thing. I, uh, like, hmm, maybe it's double Ginsu's and then the, uh, uh, that the, uh, what call it, tooth? Uh, might be, maybe that's better. The dragons, whatever. Uh, what do we need here? We need this, right? Hundred percent. Yeah, I think I'm taking these items off him. I don't like these items on him right now. I don't like it. I don't like it. Could get another Swain. Uh, yeah, let's take this off. I want the double Ginsu's. And this I'm going to give to you for now. Let's try and get two star while we're at it. Oh, that's nice. That's a better unit. So our third mage is nice. Uh, we want to keep this. So we'll sell that. We can do one more. Okay, there's the Galio and the Vex. That's actually really good. And we got 50 gold still. And we can throw that out. So we actually have 53 gold, which means we can roll... Actually, we'll roll the two and one costs. Because we actually want the two costs more than we want that. All right, all right. We're still on a lost loss streak. We're, <laughs> we're at 10 lost streaks. I don't know if this is that good. I'm going to be honest. It doesn't seem great so far. Uh, we'll go ahead and do that. Uh, go ahead and get rid of this. Uh, yay, we get two gold. That came in handy, finally. <coughs> All right, there's the... Oh, yeah, we got the Vex in. We got the Vex in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we don't need the Syndra. We don't need this. Karma is nice. We got the Vagar. We got the Vex. Who are we missing? We need another mage. Oh, the Seraphine. We need to get the Seraphine in instead of this. That's what we need. Yeah, that'll make a big difference, Dan. Come on. Come on, buddy. Hmm. I think I like the uh, Soraka here. Just getting all the, all the damage in. Oh, we're actually going to win one. Yay! Uh, I'll go ahead and click this just because I can. Cassiopeia, one of my favorite champs in this uh, set. So good right now, so hot right now, so hot. Uh, this has to come out now. Here's the problem is I have nothing for this Vex to stop them from getting absolutely hammered, which sucks. Uh, actually, I'm going to take all these and I'm going to try to get some more of my champions. Uh, Soraka I do like. Rumble I do want to keep. Oh, hello, Kench. That was fortuitous. Uh, that was really good, yeah. Okay, next combat, do something. Sure. Okay, this is good. Now we just need one more item. Come on. No, that's not the one. That's not the one. Although this is a Vanguard that I do like. Uh, wait, do I still like Vanguard? Yeah, I do. 
Who's the, oh yeah, because Galio's a bad guy, of course. Uh, it's the Jinx we don't need, right? Jinx we don't need. You're going in. Now we've got two tanks. Uh, we need a another thing though. Love to get this Vanguard in as well. Um, okay, I'll take two of them, I guess. It's so hard rolling for these champions because, like, they're so so many of them. Uh, Rumble is really not high on my priority list, so I'm not going to take that. Galio is though. Galio is super important. So we are going to take that. Is this a this is a two star Syndra, I think, or uh, Seraphine, I think. So that's good. Radiant Relics. Ooh. Magnetic Remover as well. That could be really good. I don't want that. Oh, this is actually the best. This is actually the best. Gina Manazine. Oh, wait. That's. Wait. Is Spellcasters better? Manazine's okay, but I actually think I want the Radiant Refractor. And I'll show you why in a second. I think it's the Ginsus. Now we have basically three Ginsus. Oh, yes. Here we go. All right. So now we have three Ginsus and a Hextech on one unit. All right? One unit. That is actually... Pretty sick. Okay, re-roll with all three cost champions. Yeah, I'll do that. Oh, wow. Mordecai. I'll take it. Might as well. Uh, let's go ahead and... Oh, man. Get another mage in there, too. Why don't we? Get another Vex. That's a two-star Vex. That's really good. We'll stop there for now. Look how much he's going to heal. He's going to heal himself full every single time. That is going to be really nice. Okay, so we move this in. We need seven mages. Yeah, we need the Nora and Yumi for seven. So that's fine. Your highest champion jumps to the back line. No, I definitely don't want that. Uh, but I do want to replace this. And I'm going to give you these. Because reasons. Galio, Vagar, Seraphine. Good, 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 good. Your team gains attack speed for one round. Sure, let's do it. And I'll even take a rumble. I, I will take that. I will take that bet. If we lose, I will sell the Seraphine, I think. Not too into her. So Two-star Soraka is not in anymore, which reduces my healing a little bit, which does kind of suck, but the Nami, I think, is too good. Too good to ignore. And this Galio is blasting, but still dies. Awesome. What do I sell? Seraphine? Yeah, I sell Seraphine, I think. Yep, we need the Soraka back in once we get the Nora Yumi. So, yeah, we need that. Now, we need to get uh, five more of these? No, four more of these. <laughs> Should be no problem, right? Well, we are first pick here. What, what do we want? Uh, I'm actually going to take this for the gold. Also, so no one else gets a Camille. And also, so I can give him a, uh, a Warmogs, because I think that's just worth it. Camille is nice, but uh, yeah, that's fine. Zareth is also a very good unit, but uh, doesn't fit in my comps, so can't really use you, buddy. <laughs> Sorry, friendo. Um, this goes on here. And we just keep going, I guess. Roll the dice. Four. Yay, we made two gold. Thank you. Vagar, Galio, Rumble. Uh, Seraphine, Rumble. We are at two Vanguard. Come on, one more. Oh my gosh, I didn't get it. Okay, still looking for some more of these. That's fine. Uh, we have two more vanguards here, but I don't know if we're actually going to use any of them. But right now, we just want to get this Galio three-starred, because it's kind of useless without it, to be honest. It's not that great. Uh, actually, 
to be fair, he's doing a uh, absolute ton of damage. Well, I shouldn't say that, but as you can see, we still lost. Which sucks, and we're got 24 hit points, which is really sketchy. We need to three star, we need to get really lucky. And we need to spend all our gold here, probably, after this. Oh, Gelly, that's really good. Your dummies drop gold as they take damage. Ah, uh, yeah, that seems really good. So we'll do that. <clears throat> Uh, man, I really wish I had something better than Quicksilver. If I get um, a Dragon's Claw, that'd be good. Gargoyles would be good. Uh, pretty much anything would be good at this point. Uh, there's another Vex. And there's another Rumble. Don't need that. Don't need Seraphines. I, I need Galios, please. Two more Galios, guys. Two more Galios. Let's do this, guys. Two more Galios. I actually don't care that much about Vex either. Not Vex, uh, Vagar. I, I would love more Vexes. The Vagars are not that important to me. Slightly more important than the... Uh, yeah, actually, i got to keep the Sorokas. Slightly more important than the Seraphine, maybe, but um, yeah, I don't care too much for Vagars because I'm not itemizing Vagar. Yeah, I think this is it. This Seraphine is not getting three starred anyway, so it's really not that important. Uh, let's actually just take Seraphine out of it and take Sorok out of it because we don't need either of those. Okay, we wait now and we get our gold. We are going to get a Dragon's Claw and we're going to get a Steadfast Heart. That's what we're going to get here. Right? Right game? Right? Okay, that's what we're going to get. I wonder if it's better to go down to three mages but four get four vanguards it probably is honestly right because we get like a one cost unit here and a three cost unit there i think that it's better to do vanguards right how could it not uh we want a chain vest probably Ooh, that's actually really good um Protector's Vow? No. Adaptive Helm? No. But Hand of Justice? Maybe later. I'm going to put this on you. I think that's definitely worth it. A 4 cost champion you have transforms into a 5 cost. I mean, that's only this. That doesn't seem that great. Uh, or this, I guess. Nami is good. Hagar Rumble again. Uh, oh, there's my Galio. I gotta take the Galio. Who do I get rid of? I get rid of the Vagar. Uh, do I get rid of the Rumble too? I think I get rid of Rumble for the Vagar. Oh man, we're so we're so toasted. We're gonna do that. Actually, I'm gonna sell these. We're not getting level ten. What are we, what are we thinking here? Oh, that's a lot of X's. Okay, we need to get this now. This is our chance where we need to do. There we go. Okay, and a time catch and another rumble. So that's good. I will take all of those. Uh, you are going to have one of these. Actually, we should keep rolling. Maybe. Yeah. There we go. That's good. Okay. Now we want to. If we win this, I think I'm going to switch it over. Like I said, three mage, four vanguard. Probably way better. Keep the Vex in, but we basically get two more front line and just let Galio sit in the back line and just kill everybody. It's probably way better. Because you can see, once the once he falls, or once the front line falls, everybody falls, and it's just no, it's no competition. Now he's luckily he's healing himself like crazy. And wait, we had two radiant Ginsus? That was pretty good. That was pretty good upgrade. Gain a champion duplicator. I will take that. We will get the Nami. Um, let's go ahead and put this in. And this in. And now we have a much better front line. At least on paper. Uh, we actually could go let's get this back in that is a really good unit Do 
Try my hand of justice. It's really dumb. So yeah, no, I'm not gonna do that. I do have a remover though, but I don't have anyone that wants a hand of justice, right? There's there's nobody here who wants a hand of justice at all. So I think I'll just I will just not do that. Actually, this Vanguard up here was really good because it it actually makes him significantly stronger. Well, at least more durable. Uh, no, I really wanted an eco. Okay, we need another tank item. Uh, probably this Olaf. Luckily, it's also on a four-cost unit, which is really good. But the Dragon's Claw will help quite a bit with Kench. Uh, so we'll probably frontline him now and just let him take all the damage at the beginning of the day of the game, because he's got a Gargoyle so that's going to boost his armor and magic resist through the roof. Durability. Oh, durability is an actual, like, thing now. All right, fair enough. Uh, let's do this. Let's put all these guys down here. Nope, that's not what I meant. This. This is what I meant. Let's put all these guys like that. We don't need this. We're not going to three-star this. We might actually three-star this by accident, it looks like. Uh, but we basically want to get this fifth mage in as soon as possible. So we got 44 gold to make up here. 44 gold, guys. Let's do this. Let's watch his uh, thing. Does he actually get... Uh, no, he doesn't. But he's got 170 and 235 magic resist. That's really good. He's going to survive quite a bit of time. Enough time for Galio to continually smack people's in the face. Wow, is he going to survive the whole thing? He's going to survive almost the whole game. That, or the whole match. That's crazy. Wow, what was that hit? A thousand hit? Good job. Well done, Galio. Four random uh, items become artifacts. Now, that might be good if it's like on here or here. But I actually don't think that's that good because I don't want any of these changing. And it's going to change one of those for sure because there's only 12 items or uh, 9 items out. So 100% it's going to be, well not 100 but there's a very, very good chance it's going to change one or two of these items. Which would be terrible if they turn into tank items and he just does no damage. Also if these turn into DPS, you know, t artifacts, that would be useless too, so. Yeah, not, not that great. I'm going to pass. 44 monies left. 44 monies, guys. This is what we got to do. Three-star Kassadin with a Thief's Glows. That must have been an accidental Kassadin three-star, maybe? Wow. Kench survived that whole round again. Well, not again, because he died last time. But look at that. 10,800 damage. That's pretty sickening. Okay, we should be level 8 next turn. We'll have enough gold. Uh, we're going to put this back in. And then we should be set. We should be honestly really in a good position. We want something for her. Honestly, I'd even take a blue buff at this point. Uh, spear would be great. Adaptive Helm would be fine. All of those things I could do for Nami. Because Nami actually does pretty good damage. She actually does pretty good damage. Wow, that's a lot of those. Gain a permanent three-star, one-cost champion, and a m magnetic remover. Uh, what if it's like the Seraphine or something? Let's just do it. Whatever. It's it's nine gold, right? I mean, that's actually useless. <laughs> just throw that out right there. Not needed. Uh, man, that sucks. Let's take this. Let's remove these. One, two, three. Oh, I forgot to level up. Whoops. We need a hand of justice on somebody. It's going to be you. You're the best option. Yeah, I should have leveled up. That was that was my bad. I still have one magne magnetic remover. You know, I could put this on the Yumi if I uh, get so inclined to do that. Dude, this uh, actually worked out really well. We were, like, so close to... We still are one death away, but, uh... 
we are doing really well. We might end up top two here. I think one of those guys beats us, but we've actually beaten everyone now because we're we're five in a row. So yeah, we're doing pretty well. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I'm gonna put this in, and we're gonna get ready to rumble. Rumble. Four Vanguard, five Mage. Hmm. Seems pretty good. Let's take a let's take a photo for the. Uh, for the thumbnail, can I, can I get that? No, I can't get that. I don't know why I can't zoom my guy in, but that's fine. Whatever. Okay, we'll do that afterwards, I guess. Let's see how this goes. This should be pretty good. This many-eyed beast guy kind of scares me, but he should go down pretty quick. And he gets stunned, and he gets CC'd. Thank you, Nami. Uh, I think we're okay here. We should have enough DPS by now. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. I'm tempted to sell that rumble, but I didn't. I don't know why. After 10 seconds, you can't be eliminated this round. Dude, I'm totally going to take that. That seems really good. Vagar. Vagar. Mordekaiser. One more Mordekaiser, guys. One more Mordekaiser. <gasps> Wow, dude, really? That's actually really good. Uh, do I take this stuff off her, though? Do I put, like, a Nashers on him? I don't think so, right? <laughs> that would be kind of stupid. I'll take the Vagar, though, because uh, we're actually not too far off of Vagar either. Whatever. We got lots of stuff. Uh, dude, three-star? Is that better than... No, that's not better than a two-star four-cost, right? Nami is still better. Nami like hits everybody and CCs is the nice thing about uh, about her. Wow, we wrecked this map. Oh, sorry about the cringy cutscene. Oh, Ash, you so bad, Ash. Sorry, I'll see myself out. Uh, Eldritch, we could get that. That would actually help us a little bit. Um, oh, okay. You go ahead and take that, buddy. That's fine. I didn't. Uh, I didn't need that anyway. I'm gonna take this for my uh, what's my call it guy for my Mordek. Oh wow! We we take this out for sure, right? Put this here. Now here's the question: Do we give? Uh, do we swap these over? Oh, it can't be better. Right? That's not better for sure. Can I put Yumi on Mordekaiser? I, I should be able to, right? Oh, the mini eye beast in my back line. That's awesome. That shouldn't be a problem or anything, right? Not for Galio. Not for Galio. Or Mordekaiser. Yeah, go, baby. First place. You can't beat that. Come on. What are you going to do? What are you going to do, Syndra? Give me a break. Give me a break. Okay, we're not first place yet. I'm not going to say that yet, but yeah, we could be. Uh, we need a Seraphine and a Soraka in for seven. Mage, would that be uh, Would that be the way to go? Probably not. Probably not. Uh, can you mark him, please? Yes, you can. Okay, so you actually do, like, healing, right? Heal the attached ally and grant them either 60 power... Actually, we want you on here. Don't we? Who did more tanking? Okay, Mordekaiser did a lot more damage. Actually, Mordekaiser tanked more, too. So, you know, let's go ahead and do this. I'm going to put her in the back as well. Oh, I think she attaches right away, right? So the placement actually doesn't matter. So, that's fine. Okay, this is it. If we win this, we win. I don't know that we will. He's got no good three-star units that I'm like terribly worried about. It's this many eye beast that if we can kill it, we're doing fine. Uh, it's just whether we're going to kill it or not is the question. Now, Mordekaiser is still alive and doing insanely well. I think I might take this. Uh, oh, well, it doesn't matter. We won. Well, guys, first place. Thank you very much to my sponsor, CPU Course. Go to Steam and just download CPU Course. They have a new version coming out. Uh, it helps your computer go faster. Uh, and it's amazing. 
I, this masterwork upgrade thing, every time I take it, we seem to win. I don't know, maybe there's something about that, but uh, yeah, I appreciate this, guys. Uh, thank you so much. We've had a lot of fun on this channel and some uh, good people commenting, so keep it up, and uh, we'll uh, see you in the next video.